Narayana, the Lord, through the orb of the sun, expresses himself as Narayana heat, the divine heat. Heat is another expression of the Lord. This heat that is coming out of the sun, Gam Avishya, Gam Earth, Avishya penetrating the earth. A country like India for thousands and thousands of years, we have been plowing and even today the land is not depleted, it is still fertile, could maintain the millions there. How is it possible? We plow only about three inches, three and a half inches. Therefore, we are not depleting the land. Only surface is disturbed. There it is, the organic manure is added. Cows dung urine, the rotten leaves and other things. Only organic fertilizers are used. Therefore, even though for thousands of years we have been plowing, even today it is not depleted. Many of these, today's modern industrialized or, uh, what do you call them, mechanized ma I mean, uh, cultivation, the land has become starved, starved, and in order to create it, artificial manure is necessary, which creates the entire chain of poisoning. And then her nature is upset. Now in all this, the Lord, functioning through the sun, become Narayana heat. Narayana heat when it functions on the earth, becomes the fertility in the land. Narayana fertility. And by my ojas or tejas, by my virulity, productivity, I sustain all living beings. See the statement. Gama Visya having reached the earth. Budani Dharayami. I protect, I support all beings by my ojas, my productivity, fertility. <laughs> Don't think that. Oh, Samaji, these are all only talking about the vegetarians. That we are all non vegetarian. Lord is not helping us at all. We are eating the animal. Eh? The non vegetarian can eat only herbaceous animals. Animals who are eating vegetables alone is eatable. The wolf and the tiger are not eatable. Because they are carnivorous. They themselves are non vegetarians. Their meat is full of toxins. You will die. So, a non vegetarian of today is also a vegetarian. But vegetables twice cooked. <laughs> Once cooked by the animals, and then you eat the animals. Honest vegetarians like us directly eat God's own fresh vegetables. But if the vegetation is not on the earth, vegeta vegetarians will die, admit it. But what about the non vegetarian? Since the vegetations are not there, there is no fodder. Since there is no fodder, your cattle also dies. And then you also die. Isn't it? 
So it is true when he says, I support the entire living kingdom, plant, animal and human. I protect them all and nurture, nourish them by my heat in the earth. 